So if you're wondering how to use Easy Azon with Thrive Architect, here's a quick tip uh, on this. So you cannot use it directly into the Ar Ar uh, Thrive Architect editor. Uh, what you can do is go create a test page. So go to Add New, create a new test page, and then when you when the page loads like this, um, you'll see the Easy Azon. So this is the uh, the the uh, WordPress uh, editor, the default editor of WordPress, and then you have the uh, AZAs on. So just click on it, and then you'll see this, and then you can search for uh, what what you want. So let's say coffee maker, do a search. So you will get uh, a, a list like this. So you can look at uh, the one. So if you've put the the right model number, you should be able to get. Uh, the one that you want. Uh, once you're good, you click on the text link. So there's a few images. You can create an image link, uh, a call to action link in the info block. So there's a few options. I'll just show you the text link here. So you'll get uh, this. Just make sure you, if you have multiple tracking ID, that, that the right one is selected. Uh, and then you can choose open in a new window, no follow, add to cart. So there's a few options you, you can have, or you can leave it by default and then just do insert. And then you will see the, and then you'll see the code here uh, that you can just select. So copy this, and then you go into a post or a page, and then you paste it. Uh, so I'll just show you for this. So I'm in on a, uh, a post, and then there's a few text elements. And what you could do is uh, paste it in the middle. So if, if I go, I, I'll just take a new paragraph text element. And I say, uh, so I recommend using and then uh, just paste the link. And then, uh, and then you could complete your sentence as uh, this is what I use. So, uh, and then if you preview this, uh, the uh, this will be replaced by the link. Uh, and then there's a mouse over effect, and there's all sort of effects. So, uh, this is what I recommend. So here's a preview actually. So uh, I've inserted it there, and then uh, as uh, so I recommend using. And then they have the link, and then if people mouse over, they have a preview first, and then they can click the buy or click the link. I click the prices and so on and so forth. So that would be the way of doing it. Uh, if you have any questions on this, uh, just let me know, and I'll be I'll be happy to uh, help you. There's a comment section uh, just below this post. Thanks a lot.